You've always heard between 20 and 60 ohms. Well, let me explain. Let me introduce you to the least used and most underrated tool in the irrigation industry, the multimeter. This tool measures AC voltage, DC voltage, amps in the 200 to 400 range, amps in the two to 20 amp range, continuity, and ohms. It also measures temperatures. In most cases, the first thing I use this tool for is ohms testing. Now, what I'm testing for is to make sure each of the solenoids on the given system is between 20 and 60 ohms. What does it mean when it's outside of those? Wire troubles. We can explain in a future video. Let's go ahead and go through this controller and test the ohms. We start by holding one of the prongs on the common. We use the other prong to touch to each of the wires over here. We use the other prong to touch the other side of the circuit, which in this case is over here and we're gonna start with zone one. Zone one is showing OL. OL stands for open line. I have taken the solenoid wire off of this zone to show what OL would do, and here you go. Zone two is showing 24.9. This is a good solenoid. Zone three is also showing 24, 24.2, and 25.7. All of these solenoids are good. This multimeter can also be used for continuity testing, which is the same as ohms testing in a way. Continuity testing will tell you if the circuit is complete. What it won't tell you is if there is voltage leaking on the line. 